We haven't we haven't had uh, any challenges, and and um, so we're you know looking forward to continuing to uh, move forward with that. One thing that we want to emphasize before um, somebody talks about parent expectations, we believe in comparable playing time, and I'll never forget one tournament. Uh, I was watching parents; they had stopwatches, and they were timing uh, every time their son ran on and off the field, and they walked up to me and gave me the amount of time, and you know without you know. Really, I was like a little bit blown away, and a couple. Of, one of the kids didn't want to play, and one kid was hurt, and and um, and so uh, we, um, as coaches, what we're committed to do is comparable playing time, and that is done over the balance of a tournament. So if we go to a tournament and uh, we may play one player more than other players based upon what we think is best for the team. Um, so it could be that somebody isn't feeling well. It could be that we're trying to play kids in new positions because we're behind or winning by a lot. Uh, but we ask that you'll, you'll give us uh, the opportunity to create comparable playing time over the lifespan of a tournament, uh, but we're not able to commit to having uh, equal playing time because it's uh, almost impossible uh, to do that. And, uh, but that's our commitment is to provide that comparable playing time to everyone and and uh, that's important to us, and um, that's our goal. And and uh, we would want to know in the right way uh, if if you feel like we're not hitting on that. And uh, we just want to have open lines of communication, and so that's important to us.